Y'all, it's Dan for Numerical Lion coming at you from a secret undisclosed location to talk about the secret occult practice of Gematria. It's indeed hidden, it's indeed secret, it's undisclosed. Only a few people know about it. And it's this practice of coding numbers into words using the days on the calendar, the Gregorian calendar. So, so the story today about Orson Bean, actor and guest on TV game shows, dies at 91, updated at 4.30. I'll show you why that's interesting. And the clip is 57 seconds long, which is interesting because he was born with 57 numerology, 7 plus 22, born on the 22nd of July, plus 28 is 57. And he's from Burlington, VT. And I'm out of Burlington as well, so I thought that was interesting. Burlington equals 57. And also just plain Burlington equals 57. Born on a day with 57 numerology. Born in Burlington. And the clip is 57 seconds, right? 57 seconds. And we're talking about the Scottish Rite, 57. Scottish Rite of Freemasonry. Pretty much runs everything, Hollywood, gone to everything else. So let's get on with more of the decode of the story a little bit. Let's see what happened to him. I mean, it's ridiculous. Orson Bean, a familiar face on TV, game shows, and series from Hollywood's golden age to Netflix, was fatally struck by a car on Friday evening while walking across a busy boulevard in Los Angeles, police said. B91 was walking off the crosswalk when he was struck by a vehicle and fell. Then he was struck by a second vehicle, police said. He was pronounced dead at the scene in front of the Pacific Resident Theater, where he and his wife, actress Allison Alley Mills, were company members, according to CNN. So Bean was a frequent participant on quiz shows like To Tell the Truth, Super Password, and Match Game. He made guest appearances on shows like The Twilight Zone, to Grace and Frankie. So his last movie part was in The Equalizer 2 in 2018. I'll show you why that's funny in a Gematria sort of way. So he's dead on a day with fifth 49 in numerology. 2 plus 7 plus 20 plus 20, 49, and Orson Bean equals 49. All right, this happens time and time again. Born with 49 numerology as well. And dead on a day with 49 numerology, and his name equals 49. What are the odds? 7 plus 22 plus 1 plus 9 plus 2 plus 8 is 49. Born in 28, kills 28. Was born 28. So let's take a look at him here. Orson Bean. Burlington, Vermont, as I said before, died in Venice, Los Angeles. I'll show you why that's interesting. It's all interesting. It's all part of the narrative here. The numbers, nothing in the article. You know, it's all numerically significant. So he's dead on 2 slash 7. Orson equals 27. That ritual number. You know. Look at Orson, Ritual, 27 and 81, and Orson, also 81 and 27, twice, you know, in both of these ciphers. That 36 looked familiar somehow. Um, what else? He was born on the 203rd day with 162 left, right? 162 remaining. And 81 plus 81 is 162. So double ritual. Orson Bean also equals 103. 103 is a prime number, the 27th prime number. Like he died on 2 slash 7. Like Orson equals 27. Also, 103 can be looked at as 13. Don't count the zero. It happened on a day with 13 numerology. 2 plus 7 plus 2 plus 0 plus 2 is 13. 
He was killed at age 91, 91, the 13th Triangular Rumble. Also famous for being on a game show or two, game show contestant. 91, died at age 91, 91, the 13th Triangular. And also 7 times 13 is 91. So February 7th happened to be the 38th day of the year, you know. Murder, killing, all that stuff, 38. Murder, 38. Also, 79, the 22nd Prime. I'll show you why that's interesting. And death. I've done this so many times. Death, killing. 38, died on the 38th day of the year, the day of murder, death, and killing. And he's a familiar face on TV game shows. That equals 38, also 43. That story was updated at 430. And struck by a car equals 43. Also 83. 83, that murder number again. Struck by a car, 83. Right? And murder, 83. Our car it was definitely murder, killing 43, Masonic 43. I have that here somewhere. Killing. Oh, maybe they don't. So, killing 43, just like 38, Masonic, same numbers 43, 74, 38. So, it's he was struck right in front of here, the Pacific Resident Theater, 218, 110, and 133. And that's interesting because death equals 218 in English extended cipher, very relevant cipher. Death, 218, number of death. And talk about the equalizer, his last part was in the equalizer in 2018. I forgot what the equalizer 2 equals. Something relevant, no doubt. Well, you know, sacrifice number, equalizer. Satanic, fun. Um, it's in game shows, also 110 and 133, just like Pacific Resident Theater, known for being on game shows. 110, 133, just like Pacific Resident Theater. Bean equals 22 and 13 and 86. Remember, we were talking about 79, the 22nd prime number. Bean, 22. Also, this number is big. So, born on the 22nd, this happened on a day with 13 numerology, remember? And blood sacrifice. Born on, and he was born on a day with 76 numerology. 7 plus 22 plus 19 plus 28 is 76. These are blood sacrifice numbers. Also, he was on the game show Super Password equals 86 and 76. All right. Born on 76 numerology. And he's from Burlington, Vermont. 86 also. Blood sacrifice and 220, just like 22, born on the 22nd, bean equals 22. Blood sacrifice, 76 and 86. He's a journeyman actor, 67 and 86, 67, another sacrifice number. Sorry, blood sacrifice. Blood sacrifice also 67, along with 76 and 86, big numbers in this story. Um, accidentally hit that. And if you look at Bean and Carr, you know, 22, 13, and 23, syncs up. Also 59 is number of kill in Jewish gematria, very relevant cipher. Jewish kill is 59, also 59, the 17th prime number, just like kill, right? Um, also, he 
died in Venice, Los Angeles, 86. We talk about that number, the blood sacrifice number. And 167 is interesting because he, from his this day to his 92nd birthday, his upcoming was 167 days. 167, a prime number. No, the one... 167, the 39th prime, like masonry. You know, masonry definitely had its hand in this, just like they have their hand in almost everything else. So that'll do it. Rest in peace to this man, Orson Bean. When I saw his name, I thought he was English, but turns out he was born in Burlington, Vermont. So that was a bit of a surprise. And his wife, I didn't decode her name because there's so much to decode. We could go on and on with this, you know. But let's look at her name just for fun. Allison Allie Mills. See that, how that weaves into this tapestry. <laughs> and of course, we got these blood sacrifice numbers. 67 and 257. That's what's going on here. Blood, that other blood sacrifice number, also 202, like 22, right? We've got blood sacrifice, also 257 and 67, just like Allison Alley Mills, his wife. And he's walking off the crosswalk. Sure, he was. Now, this man was murdered, 59, like kill, 121, that other number for blood sacrifice, also 49, like it's happened on a day with 49 numerology, Orson Bean equals 49, he was born with 49 numerology, right? And blood sacrifice, we just mentioned that, is 121, same cipher as crosswalk, so... And rest in peace to this man. He probably knew the deal, though. Hollywood's golden age. One more. Hollywood's golden age. You know, and this comes on the heels of the death of... What's his name? Kirk Douglas. Who was in Hollywood's golden age. Huh. Hollywood, Hollywood's golden age. 218, like death. 79, like murder. I mean... Always, right? And then Netflix, 36. There was a 36 in here somewhere. I don't remember exactly, but that seems familiar. 36. Um, oh, yeah, Orson 36, right? Orson 36, Netflix 36. That's why he's on Netflix. All right, I'll get out of here now. You know, because you could go on and on, and, and, I, and I do. I probably go on more than I should, but I think people need to know how scripted things are. And this is not organic. This happens all the time with these guys. They're ritually sacrificed. To advance somebody's career, to, to celebrate an event, you know, sacrifices for the big game, sacrifices for the upcoming big game, etc., etc. It's all about sacrifice. All right, well, thank you so much. Learn the code, spread the code, each one, teach one. <laughs>